laughing. Hi, I'm Miko. I'm with Century 21 Hometown Realty. And I'm April Hugh. I'm with Century 21 Hometown Realty. And today we have Ryan Frigier. Frigier. <laughs> Uh, with um, Apex Tinting. Welcome, Ryan. Yes, thank you. Appreciate you guys having me on. Yeah. So how long have you been in the business? So uh, Apex itself has been around since 2000. So we actually just celebrated 21 years this, right. this, this past March. So that was pretty cool. Um, we, I myself have been doing window tinning on the window tinning side for about that to about 20 years of it. Okay. So, so it, window tinning has been around for a while then. So. Oh yeah, window tinning's really, you know, about the 80s, there was, was really some of the first window films that came out and were designed. And uh, obviously most people think about window tint for their cars, but um, we actually do quite a bit of it for, for homes and also for businesses, for people that are having different issues. Okay. Yeah, I had this one house, this listing, and it was facing east, so he had all the back, and they were big windows. They were tinted, and it just completely eliminated the sun, you know, the brightness the coming yeah. out. Yeah. So it was did it make scary. it dark? No, it was. It, it was just, just right. Still, nice. Yeah, just like yeah. a perfect. So, I mean, do you go out there and kind of assess what? what exactly what we was? do. Exactly what we do. Yeah. In most homes, when we go out, we're trying to uh, really get a balance. You know, we have stuff from completely clear that you don't even know is on the windows that will give you oh. UV protection and heat rejection to medium films where we start getting some glare reduction to real dark if you're looking for privacy or major heat rejection. Um, we kind of have everything, the whole, the whole spectrum there that we can, and really it's about tailor fitting it to the house. Um, I have a lot of films that are in different lines that have a different shading. So we can actually do different shades. Maybe we're gonna put something a little bit darker on the south and west facing that's getting the sun the majority of the day and something lighter that's gonna be on the east and north side to make sure we're still letting enough light into the house so it doesn't feel dark and closed off. I, I call it husband and wife film. Usually the husband's going black it out and the wife's going, no, let the light in. So we, we, we're always looking for that compromise right in the middle. Well, the sun is so damaging. It just fades your furniture and fades everything if, if you're not exactly. careful. Yeah. yeah. Now, do you have like kind of a rose tint or do you just pretty much? Yeah, we have uh, the <laughs> colored colored glasses. <laughs> rose colored glasses. We actually do have stuff in, in the bronze color, rose colored. Okay. Uh, most people are looking for more, more of a kind of a gray neutral, something that doesn't really stand out too much on the windows and that's usually what we're using yeah. um, that you know looks nice. And, and we can also look at the exterior coloring of the uh, house too and try to get stuff that looks closer to the color of the house so it blends in and looks nice from the, especially on, if you're uh, from the front of the street. Mm -hmm. Obviously it's not as big of a deal for doing the back of the house. Well, you can advise your clients on this would look good, this would not. And exactly. exactly right. That, that's, you that's, have an eye for... Yep, been doing it long enough that we can know how, what, what looks good on what. And, uh, and, and a lot of times we can also put up samples too and let them look at different samples, different shades, different film lines so they can get a good feel for what it would look like on their house before we actually go out and install it. So what is an average window cost? So, so it's all based on square footage. Right. So, um, you know, we have films all the way down from $6 a square foot all the way up through $18 a square foot okay. for some of the real um, uh, elaborate films that, that we can get into. Um, a good middle road is usually about $8, $9 a square foot. You know, so if uh, you got a standard, let's say a standard, um, you know, five by three windows, 15 feet, you know, you're, you're probably gonna be 160 bucks. Oh, that's just, not bad just, at just all, just yeah. Basic number and of course we have quantity also as, as we go do more square footage generally we can give breaks as we go up and so from when you install it how long does it usually last so all of our films if we install them on a home mm -hmm. lifetime warranty so as long as you own the home wow. you're covered against any kind of bubbling cracking or peeling okay. I always tell people everything has a shelf life right I mean this window film is actually taking the brunt of the sun in most of the situations so most films are going to last 15 to 20 years depending on which directions it's facing. Okay. About how long would it take to do a whole house? Um, depending on how much square footage I mean a standard house that maybe has you know 400, 600 square feet that's about a day project uh, we've been on some larger jobs that you know that can run out a couple days depending on you know if, if the home's got um, the you know smaller um, French pane windows in it that take a lot longer to do more uh, and more detailed work in that so uh, but most of our most of our jobs are done in a day do you feel like your business has picked up since COVID? COVID has been interesting for business yes. yeah it seems like on the residential commercial side it has picked up uh, there's seems like there's a lot a lot of construction going on that we're doing a lot on the commercial side and and um, along with homeowners too I think they've been home more 
And what we're seeing is that they're noticing hot spots in their house. They're noticing spots where um, you know, the sun's maybe coming in more and fading because they got the blinds open during the day because they've been there. So we're going out and helping them prevent that fading, okay. uh, get heat rejection, or maybe that's got glare on their TV screen that they're looking for. Oh, right. Yeah, right. That too. Yeah, yeah that's, that's great. great. I always have to close the blinds because when the sun gets to a certain, certain, spot. certain yeah. spot, I'm like, ah, can't You're see. You're done, yeah. 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 So do you give, do you go out, um, do you charge for estimates? Free, free estimates. No, estimates. We'll, we'll come out and take a look at it, um, you know, help the homeowner through that. A lot of times we can actually bring some of the product with us if it's a small job let's say you just got one window there's there a lot of times we can show up take a look at the window if the if the um, if the homeowner likes what we got we can just get get it installed right there but on a larger project we'd like to be a little bit more prepared come with that film already pre-cut ready to go for all the different windows okay so now what are the, your areas so, so we service everything from Paso Robles to San Ynez uh, also out to, to Lompoc and, and Vandenberg of course uh, so and everything in between Oh, yeah. that's great. And you have a, a big staff or is it? Is yeah, we, we got, we, yep, we got a couple of window tenders. Um, we also do auto glass replacement. So if you mm -hmm. got a broken windshield or something like that, we got a large crew that goes out and does that mobile too. Um, of course, we can tint your car also. We do that at our Santa Maria shop. And, uh, but yeah, we got plenty of guys that go out and do, do the window tenders. Wonderful. Sure. Great. Okay, and then curious about solar and decorative films. Yeah, so there's a lot of different kinds of window films, and those are okay. two, two kinds. Uh, solar films, kind of what we've been talking about, is okay. generally shaded films. It's kind of what you would think of when you tint your car. It's something that you can see through um, in that, and that, but it has solar properties as far as reducing the heat, reducing UV, and um, also glare. Privacy as a whole is, is, is a, a kind of emerging thing. It's coming out a little bit more now, which is more of the frosted films. Um, so let's think, think of a bathroom window that, that, oh, that right, you're, right. You, you move into you move a new home, if yeah. you've got a clear bathroom window, we can put frosted films on there to help uh, you know, stop the Excellent. view. But there's also different kinds of patterns we can do. We can do different pictures. You can get stuff with vines and leaves and make it look almost like stained glass. Uh, it's, there's a large array of, of uh, different films that we can do. I didn't even know that. Yeah, that is so... Replacing, yeah. you know, instead of replacing a window, so I do it a lot on bathroom windows. I do it a lot on some of the newer track homes where the homes are close together and, and there's a window that's yes. looking at your neighbor's house. Right. We can put something on those so you have a, a, a decorative, almost like a picture on your window, but it, you know, it also stops that view okay. of whatever might be next door. And I, I mean, this, you know, when there's a, a dual pane window and the, the seal fails and it's a cloudy, yes. I mean, would, that, would, would a decorative film be something of, I mean, I know that that's, yeah, a decker, a decker film would cover that up, yes. um, but it's, you know, obviously the yeah. sit fail fail is still there, unfortunately. So yeah. generally the only way to fix that is, is to pop a new window in it. Right. Yes. <laughs> yes. But it is. I, I've done that before uh, just to, you know, take it out of view right. and, and that, especially if it's on a window that's not really looking at anything. Look, if you're looking at the fence or something. Or maybe right. not used very much yeah. or exactly. something like that. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Exactly. So. I like that. But, but just some of the other films that we do, it just, you know, building on the solar and, um, and decorative film, we do also have security films. So those are thicker films that we can actually put on for security reasons. Oh. On a home, it makes sense, you know, especially if you have a glass door, say you have a glass back door where someone could easily break that window and reach in and unlock the door, we can put thicker films on those to help Help. And when it breaks, it actually helps hold the glass together. And oh, wow. it can never oh, completely gosh. stop someone from coming in, but a lot of times someone breaks it, it doesn't fall apart yeah. like they're ex yeah. expecting. And, and, and so at that point, they figure, I've already made enough noise, I'm just going to get out of here. Still got a broken window, but at least uh, oh, it, it can sometimes good. prevent yeah. intrusion. We do it a lot for also for commercial buildings and, and that for smash and grab reasons and that. Mm -hmm. So um, definitely a, a big. Uh, point also. I've never heard yeah, of that. That's I, great. This is great information. Yeah. 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 And anti graffiti, anti graffiti films are kind of the same thing, but they go on the outside. Okay. We don't have much of a tagging problem in our in our city here, but in the big cities, it's it's and, and we do do it here, where if you're having an issue where someone's coming along and etching into your window, we can put a film on the exterior. So when they're etching, it actually goes into the film. Then you pull that piece of film off, you put a new piece on, and it's much cheaper than replacing your whole piece of glass. So it's just something to. Oh, that's really interesting. I mm -hmm. never knew those things. Yeah, yeah. That's great. That's really cool. All, all, yep. That's what we trying to get that information out there. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Build awareness. <laughs> that's wonderful. Well, thank you so much for joining yeah. us and giving us great yeah. information. No well, yeah. I'm
Well, do you have any promotions or any kind of... Uh, yeah, on our website, if you go to our website, we do have a specials and those are always changing. Right now, I think we have $50 off anything over 50 square feet. So if you want to get your house tinted and you, you just, even if it's a smaller project, you can save $50 on that. Um, and then there's also some promotions on there for, for our auto glass and, and automotive tinting side too. Okay. Thank you for coming in. It was great information. Yeah, we enjoyed talking with you. It was a great presentation. Thank you for having me. I really appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, and if you need any more information, please give us a call. My number is 805-878-5056. And I'm at 805-714-8124. Thanks for watching. Yeah, we'll see you soon. To see more information, um, go ahead and click on that button and you can reach me at 805-714-8124. And my number is 805-878-5056. Thanks for watching. Yeah, we'll see you soon. Bye.